I'm Chris and Chris, and welcome to So Cool Science, science you can do right at home. This is not trash, and I'm going under today's science file. In today's science file, it says, What are some ways I can reduce land pollution at home? Well, that's a great question. Try this. You will need a milk jug, a pot bottle, and a glass pickle jar. Today, I'm going to show you how to reduce your land pollution by turning everyday trash items that you throw away into things that you can reuse again and again. Because I am going to show you how to turn this milk jug, this glass pickle jar, and this pot bottle into five completely different things that you can reuse again and again. So let's get started. Start by cutting off the tops of the pot bottle and the milk jug. We can use the bottoms as flower pots. You can use the top of the milk jug as a shovel for the dirt. Add a plant and then fill in the dirt around the plant. Once planted, you can use the top of the pot bottle as a funnel to help direct the water where you want it. Add about two to three drops of super glue to the bottom of the cap and attach a magnet. Grab another magnet and attach that to the metal lid. You now have refrigerator magnets. Now check this out. I was able to turn a milk jug into a flower pot and a scoop. I was able to turn a pot bottle into a flower pot and a funnel. The glass jar can be used as a drinking glass. And I was even able to turn the plastic lid and the metal lid into refrigerator magnets. Now that's pretty wicked cool. So, why not just send all this stuff to the trash or to a recycling center? Why reuse it? Well, don't look at me. Take a closer look at this. When we look at the percentage of landfill pollution, we see that paper and cardboard make up 30% of all the trash that's thrown out as garbage. If you add up the amount of plastic and glass that ends up in our landfill, that's another 25% each year. So what may look like a pile of garbage to you could actually be treasures as well as money saved, which would have ended up buying these things as brand new objects. So by reusing plastic and glass jars, as well as using your computer instead of paper, we can reduce about half of the pollution we send to landfills each year. You might think that you should send these things to a recycling plant, but recycling plants often throw out about 40% of what you send to be recycled due to biohazards to other humans. So in recycling plastic, glass, and tin cans, make sure that those things have been cleaned out before you ship them to be recycled. Landfills are also expensive places to maintain, and those expenses end up coming out of the pockets of taxpayers. So the less trash we throw away, it means the less maintenance, as well as the less we have to pay for as taxpayers. Thus making this world both an economic and eco-friendly place to live. So now you know how to reduce pollution. You know, turning trash into everyday items is why science is so cool.